当称谢进入他的门，当赞美进入他的院，当感谢他，称颂他的名。诗篇一百四。Devotional, a life of thanksgiving. How thankful are you when you talk to God? The world around us generally doesn't encourage thankfulness. We are taught to look after ourselves in order to get what we think we deserve, but we're not generally taught to be thankful. And yet, Christians ought to be the most thankful people on earth, because we have been given everything by God. James 1:17 reminds us that every good gift comes from God. This implies that God is always acting in kindness toward us. Not only has God given us life and breath, but He has also offered us the free gift of eternal life. God made a way for us to have a relationship with Him through the death. And the resurrection of Jesus. That alone is more than enough for us to live in gratitude toward God. That is why our hearts should be in constant state of thanksgiving. And yet, we often find ourselves complaining because things don't go the way we want. We grumble because we don't have the things we think we deserve, and the more that we complain, the more our hearts grow critical and bitter. Thankfully, Psalm 100 gives us the antidote for grumbling and complaining. Thank, thankfulness. Thanksgiving is a spiritual habit that we have to intentionally develop through continual practice. We can practice by taking time each day to talk with God and to thank Him for all He has done for us. We can also practice by telling others how grateful we are for them. So the next time you find yourself complaining or grumbling, take a moment to think about the love and the goodness of God in your life. Instead of complaining, express how thankful you are for who God is and what He has given you. Keep a list of things you are grateful for and add. To it throughout the week, watch as your heart and mind begin to be transformed by the simple act of thanksgiving. Prayer, God, I'm so grateful I have the opportunity to have a relationship with you. Thank you for not only blessing me with your presence, but for Wanting good things for me, I'm honored to serve you, Lord. I pray that all I do will bring glory and honor to you. In Jesus' name, Amen. Scripture: 当称谢进入他的门，当赞美进入他的院，当感谢他，称颂他的名。诗篇一百四。Enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him and praise his name. Psalm 104. 普天下当向耶和华欢呼，因为耶和华本为善，他的慈爱存到永远，他的现实直到万代。诗篇一百一。和五 Shout for joy to the Lord, all the earth, for the Lord is good and His love endures forever. His faithfulness continues through all generations. Psalm 101 and 5. Honor God. 洪水泛滥之时。
，耶和华坐着为王，耶和华坐着为王，直到永远。耶和华必赐力量给他的百姓，耶和华必赐平安的福给他的百姓。诗篇二十九十到十一。The God who has authority over the heavens forever is also the God who is with us in this moment. As you reflect on God's power and authority, bring Him whatever words of worship come to mind. My concerns: 神所赐出人意外的平安，必在基督耶稣里保守你们的心怀意念。菲利比书四。七 Whatever is on your mind matters to God. Spend the next few moments presenting your requests and concerns to Him. God's will, God, at all times, let Your will be done in me. I know this isn't an easy thing to say. I know that following You requests. Requires us accepting struggles that are beyond my control, but I also know that your plans are good, and I want to take a part in those plans. So today, sur- I surrender. Teach me your will, in Jesus' name. Amen.